folks, I'm reading the line, the rules for standing outside to get in the Hall H for people who have standard badges, and it contains an enormously illogical contradiction. Listen, I want to read this to you in its entirety. Are you ready? Go. All right. So I start right here. We know you want to be the first in line for a lot of Comic-Con events, especially Hall H, but there are certain guidelines to always keep in mind. With Comic-Con, while Comic-Con discourages any lineups in advance in Park Plaza adjacent to Hall H, if you do find yourself in line for an extended period of time, please adhere to these rules. For safety issues, we cannot allow anyone to line up in Park Plaza until all tents, canopies, stanchions, and work are completed at the park. This also includes areas adjacent to the park. Please, no waiting nearby for work to be completed. We anticipate that all work will be finished sometime on Tuesday, July 19th. However, this is not a guarantee. Because this is a safety issue, we have been told that anyone waiting in the area before all work is completed will be asked to leave regardless of the time of arrival or length of time they have been waiting. So far, so good. Okay, that, that makes sense. That makes sense. This is where it gets a little confusing. I was going to say a little confusing, but I changed my mind. It just gets confusing, folks. Here we go. In an effort to accommodate as many people as possible with the least amount of impact for all. Please follow the rules below. Camping is not allowed. No tents, canopies, inflatables, cots, beds, furniture, large coolers, heaters, large fans, large umbrellas, chase lounges, open flames or anything of similar size of any kind as determined by the San Diego Convention Center. You are allowed to have one chair per person of relatively normal size. You may use a sleeping bag or blanket as well provided it is only taking up the space of one person. <clears throat> That's camping folks. That's camping. You camp with a sleeping bag. So camping is allowed. The problem here is that some security guard whose power's gotten a little bit to them can come over and say, excuse me, you're camping, you gotta leave. Now, Comic-Con's really chill. I seriously doubt that's gonna happen. But, you know, it's just kind of like the rule invites that, you know what I mean? That contradictory set of rules. Let's continue right here. No facilities or services will be available at Plaza Park, so plan accordingly. In other words, if you've got a whiz, do it beforehand. Restroom access will be available in Lobby G of the Convention Center from 9 p.m. to 7 a.m. each night starting Tuesday, July 20th. No other access to facilities will be available, but that's nice, though. Please respect the grounds and dispose of trash in trash receptacles. Please do not leave any trash or waste behind. Comic-Con will once again be utilizing the Toucan Tracker wristbands for the first panel of each day in Hall H. More information, information on that will appear tomorrow, Tuesday, July 12th, here on Toucan. Check back for another Toucan tip tomorrow here on Toucan, the only official SDCC blog. Bookmark Toucan and the Comic-Con front page for the latest updates for Comic-Con International 2016. That's exciting. Boy, just reading that just makes my blood boil. That contradiction, though.